Today, I'm going to show you a new one click AI agent that is just absolutely wild. It can do almost anything. And, you know, if you're waiting for an invite code to Manus or if you're reaching the daily usage limits and you want a solution in the meantime, this is probably the best AI agent I've ever seen. I'll show you how to build anything, automate anything. It can use your browser. You can log in to accounts. I've even tested it for like emails and sending emails. It's absolutely wild. So let me show you exactly what I'm talking about and how this works. And by the way, you don't need an invite code for this. You don't need to pay for the actual software, only the API costs. But it's completely free. And if you want to use it completely free with APIs, you just grab a free API key from Google. And it's all available inside Visual Studio Code. So if you make sure you download Visual Studio Code, which is available at code.visualstudio.com, and then you go to RuCode, right? So you're just going to make sure you go to extensions and then type in RuCode. Like so. what you've got here is essentially something so powerful. It's the most autonomous AI agent I've ever seen, right? So if you go over to RuCode over here, you can see that, for example, it can set up like MCP servers. So it's linked directly to Perplexity and started running searches for us directly right here. But not only that, like that's just a little minuscule thing compared to everything else it could do, right? This is all done with one single click. For example, here, you can see we said go to Gmail and write an email to me at juliangola.com, inviting him to an SEO party, write this manually, don't use the contact section, and it just went off and actually did its magic. So if we scroll up and we go here, you can see it actually drafted the email inside my browser. So it has browser use. And the reason that it has browser use is because it's connected to Anthropic. So I've plugged in my API key from Anthropic, just go to console.anthropic.com, then select your model as Claude 3.7 Sonic. Once you've done that, then you're going to run your Chrome in debug mode. If you don't know how to do that, just get the SAP inside the AI Profit Boardroom with the copy and pasteable prompts. And from here, just enable the browser tool, set up your local host, test the connection like you see right here, and then boom, you're done. That's how easy it is, right? And then you can see here, it just wrote an email directly for us. Really simple and easy. And if we scroll down here as well, you can see that I said, go to WordPress and write a beautifully formatted blog, targeting the keyword, blah, blah, blah. And it can just go off and do that. Let me show you an example of that in action. So if we type in that prompt over here, it's going to run the API request. And by the way, all this stuff, send emails, writing blog posts, etc., has only cost me 65 cents. And again, if you want to use it for free, just plug in your Google API keys. It's going to open up a new browser here. Then it's going to start going to post.new. And from here, it can start right in the blog post. So the cool thing about this is you can basically automate any task with AI now because it can write blog posts. It can interact with your tools. It can figure out how to use stuff. It can write emails for you. Like it's incredibly easy. And then if we go back to that blog post it wrote, here's an example. So it's like launch a new browser. Then I'll navigate to the URL. Then I'm going to write this. The blog post has been published, as you can see. So I actually published the blog on my website. And we've gone from AI tools that can actually write content to AI tools that can actually navigate to your website and publish content, like you can see right here. So if we actually go to juliangoldie.com and then go to the blog section, that is the blog that it published today, right? And it's all nicely formatted. It's actually pretty nicely written compared to most human writers. And it did all its magic pretty much automatically. Really simple and powerful to do. Here's another example. So we said create a presentation. If we, so we basically asked it to create a website about this, blah, blah, blah. And then I'm going to say, open this up for me. And it basically coded a website locally, like you can see right here one single prompt and then launched it inside my browser. So you can see it's opening up the landing page for us right here. We'll wait for that to load. And that is our website, my friends. Look at that. Ready to go. And you can see it like just scrolling through the website right there. All right. So it can build stuff. You can automate stuff. It can even go to Ahrefs and start doing keyword research. Let me show you an example of that in action. So if we go over here, I said, I need to conduct comprehensive keyword research, blah, blah, blah. Use a browser to do that. It figured everything out. It found a bunch of keywords and it just started using this tool autonomously. All right. So you see the API request. 
this is faster and smarter than the actual VA. So it found us a bunch of keywords right here. They were pretty low competition, like Boys SEO Agency, Thai SEO Services, Bangkok SEO Company, Best SEO Company in Poon, SEO Company Forum, etc. Like some really interesting keywords that I would have never found. And it did it using Ahrefs directly. And you can see the task is completed there. So really powerful stuff. You can basically automate whatever you want using this process. Let me pull up an example. So here's an example of Ahrefs being used. Now, if you want to do this, let me put in an example prompt. If you want to test this out yourself. So we'll plug this in here. And we'll say research Sheila and Goldie, then build and deploy the best possible website you can about me. It's finding the information, as you can see. So it said, great, I found some information about Julian Goldie. Now let's start building out the website. Let's see what it does next. It's trying to use the Plexi MCP server as well to do that. And there you can see it started to do its magic right here. So it's got all the information about me. And because this is linked to MCP servers, it can do that research, connect to the internet, and then use that to start building out the website, right? So if we run this command, now it's going to start building out the JS, the CSS, the images, etc. I'll create the HTML for the website, right? So you can see here, like it can use the internet, it can use a browser, it can start creating HTML. It can code locally, but it can also code via MCP servers. And again, you don't need to have any coding skills to be able to use this stuff. You just get the AI to do it for you. That is literally the future, but it's so autonomous and it doesn't require an invitation code from Manus. It doesn't require paying for any software. It doesn't require a daily usage limit. Like the freedom that you have with this is far bigger and better than anything else I've seen out there. You can also open up multiple windows. So if you open up a new window, let's close that. But if we go back to Visual Studio Code over here, open up a new window. We can now start running more tasks in the background whilst the AI agent is coding, right? So it's coding over here, but then inside this window, we can start using its magic. So let's run another prompt. And for this one, just going to do something basic, right? So for example, inside here, I'm going to say, Google the latest AI headlines today and build a website around that. I right? actually, we need to use root code, not that was client. Don't use client. Use recode. All right. So it's going to start open up the browser. There you go. It's searching the latest AI news today inside Google. It's actually used the Google AI overviews to figure that out. It's grabbing that information, searching for it, having a look through Google, seeing what's going on, and then using that to research, right? So you can see the screenshot here. You can see how it's navigating the page over here. And now it's like, right. Now I'll create, it's I've gathered several AI headlines. Now I'll close the browser and build a website to showcase these new stories. And so it does all the research for you. And then it just goes off and builds a website for you. You don't need to pay a design agency $10,000 to do that. I'll just go off and do it for you. We'll hit save on that. And then we should be able to preview it. Now, also the cool thing is because we're using Claude, Claude is the best for coding, for front end, everything else. This website is nearly finished. So this is the one about Julian Goldie which it built using the MCP servers from Perplexity. So the main thing here is like you become extremely powerful using AI agents and you've got an army of agents, right? So at the same time, look at this, right? We've got one AI agent coding a website about me. And then we've got another AI agent at the same time doing research and coding a website about the latest AI news headlines. And so it's absolutely insane what you can do and how you can do it. I'm pretty sure if you said go to Twitter and post a tweet about what's happening in the world, it could just go off and do that. And that is a website. Look at that. Boom. Ready to go. It's found the information. It's even figured out, okay, this was from 15 hours ago. This is a source, etc. It's added some nice icons. We could improve the design of the website if we want. The main thing here is like to go from idea to concept. Now the feedback loop is like minutes, not days or weeks or months, like it would normally be of a website. If you wanted to build an e-commerce site, or you wanted to build a SaaS tool, or you want to build an app, or you just want it to go off and send some emails for you, do some outreach for you. It can do all of that. And it's very good at what it does, right? And again, to do all of this, we only spent 25 cents. It's insane. And again, you can use Google AI Studio instead if you prefer that. And then with that, you know, you've got the option to to use it for free, right? Because you can go into ai studio.google.com and grab a free API key there.
you can see how powerful this is. It genuinely is a one-click AI agent. It's doing all the work for me. If we have to list out, okay, what do I need a person for? Let's open up a new document here. You know, if we pull this up and we ask ourselves, okay, website developers, we've replaced with AI. Human writers, replaced with AI, right? The AI can now go onto Twitter and it can send posts for us as well. Social media posts, the AI can do as well. And not just like writing them, but actually going on and uploading them, right? So for example, if we open up a new post here, and let me just double check this. I want to make sure if we go to Twitter, I'm just going to switch to another account. So we switch it to this account instead. All right. And then what I'm going to do from here is I'm going to say to Recode. And by the way, that's the website ready to go. It's already iterated on it and improved the design. X off that. We'll start a new task and we'll say, go to Twitter and post a tweet. All right. And then inside here as well, we'll say, write a short, inspiring quote about AI and post a tweet, no hashtags. Okay. Let's see if it can do that. I don't know if Claude is going to restrict it for going to Twitter and posting content, but let's see if it can. So it's going to Twitter now. All right. So this is on my AI SEO mastery account, which is like a, a totally separate account. I don't want to do it on my main live one. Let's see if it can do its magic. And I'm, it says it cannot because it's restricted, right? So it says, according to my guidelines, I'm not permitted to generate content, but it seems like Claude has really restricted that. I think because it probably goes against the guidelines. So it gives us the actual prompt and the content, but it won't write it. Can you draft that tweet inside Twitter for me? Let's see if it will do that. So it's going over to Twitter again. I don't know if it's going to do that. I think it might be quite restricted, but we'll see what it does. Is he going to figure that out? It's writing. There we go. I'm just going to hit post for it. And boom shaka like a, it's done the tweet. AI doesn't replace human creativity. It amplifies it. Together, we're exploring new frontiers of possibility that neither could reach alone. All right. So you can actually write tweets for us as well. So that's on the list. So if we look at, okay, what have we replaced? And I think. The difference right now is not the, is the difference here is like not the AI agents are restricted in terms of what they can do. The only restriction that we have is that most humans don't understand how powerful this is, right? Because most people don't realize it can replace website developers, it can re replace content writers and human writers, not like tomorrow or next month or in one year's time, like right now, SaaS stores, it can build. So for example, outreach emails, any type of virtual assistant, admin tasks, keyword research, building out websites, SEO tasks in general is <laughs> basically replaced. All right. And so the list is just getting longer and longer. And this is all possible with RuCode. I don't think most of this stuff is possible with anything else. Manus can't do that because it's got limits. An AI tool could write content, but it's not going to be able to do the rest of this. But with RuCode, We've replaced all of this stuff, plus much more. I've not even touched the surface, but you get the idea. This is all the crazy stuff that you can do with it. So if you want to get the SAP for this, it's all inside the AI Profit Boardroom. Feel free to get that. If you just go to Classroom, then scroll down to SAPs. You'll find the SAP for setting all of this stuff up with Ruco directly inside here. And again, you might be saying, okay, this is great, but is it free? It's free if you use aistudio.google.com. Grab the API key, plug that into your settings. All right. Is it good? Is it as good as Manus? I would say a lot of the outputs are actually better. And also you don't have to wait for an invite code. It can code locally. It can log in to your Twitter account or whatever you want it to do. And also it can interact with your browser. And on top of that, there's no usage limits, right? So it's not in a virtual environment or anything like that. Plus it costs pennies to do, literally pennies to do that. All right. So to do all these steps right here. Only cost us what zero point one one dollars, right? Nothing, not much at all. Especially if you compare that to the price of say getting a virtual assistant to do all this for you. And again, Rucode it doesn't take days off, it doesn't take Sundays off, mate. Just gets on with the job and does its magic. So that's the difference right here. Now, if you want to get all of this, it's inside the AI Profit Boardroom. Link in the comments description. Just go to the Rucode section here to get the instructions. It also comes with 
the instructions on how to set up MCP agents, NA10 MCP agents. It's got a three hour course on DeepSeek and a three hour course on Manus. It gets updated every single month. It comes with weekly Q&A calls with us. So you can jump on the Q&As and ask us any questions. And inside the community as well, you can dive into the community, ask any questions you have, and we're all trying to help you. So you can see this question right here. We've all helped everyone inside the community. People share all the cool stuff they've done as well, which is pretty crazy. And it's just a community of people, entrepreneurs, dedicated to making more money and saving hundreds of hours with AI. So thanks so much for watching and appreciate you watching. If you want to get that link in the comments in the description. Additionally, if you want to get a free one-to-one -one SEO strategy session that shows you how we take websites from zero to 145,000 bits this month and generate hundreds of thousands of dollars in sales on autopilot, feel free to get that link in the comments in the description. You get a custom tailored game plan to your website to generate more lead sales and profits from SEO. You'll get your questions answered one-to-one. -one. You'll learn the best link bonus strategy for your website plus how to 10 SEO traffic based on what's working for us and our happy clients like you can see right here. Feel free to get that link in the comments in the description. Appreciate you watching and I will see you on the next one, my friends.